Hello and welcome to the Tea Party Hardy channel. Okay, this is my fourth time of doing this video, so let's see if I get it right this time. Black Lives Matter and all of this insurgency that is promoted by the Democrat Party and celebrated, and Kamala Harris is on the record, on Colbert, saying they better keep doing it until the election. You can look it up. And you've heard all the other politicians and you've seen all the endorsements and you've seen Goodyear endorsing them and you've seen Nike endorsing them and Coca-Cola and who doesn't have Black Lives Matter on their pages. This killing is going to act to America what the IRA did to Ireland. This civil war, and we're in a civil war now, guys. This is what it looks like. This civil war the longer it goes, the harder it is to stop because you killed one of ours, now we're going to kill one of yours, now we're going to kill two of yours, and now we're going to kill three of yours, and it just keeps escalating. There will come a time if we're not careful, and ladies and gentlemen, we're not being careful. We're just like in Ireland and any other place that's had a civil war. The people, just like Portland, get used to having the mayhem and just walking around it. If you've seen movies or documentaries, whatever the case may be, of the American Revolution in Boston, the war's going on in Boston. But you know what? People still had to go to work. But the war is going on. Yet yeah, you just walk around it and hope you don't get killed in the process. It was no different in World War II. It was no different in Vietnam. It was no different in any country's war. Life has to continue, even if the war is going on, and you just hope you don't get killed in the process. Portland is that way. Seattle is that way. Atlanta is that way. Minnesota is that way. There's too many cities to list, and they all have the exact same thing in common. They're all run by Democrats. This is not a statistical error. This is... You get the leaders you ask for. But the point of this video, for the fourth and final time, we have to stop it or people will get used to it. And once people get used to it, it's literally a habit. And habits are very hard to break. And we don't want to be in the habit of killing Americans from Americans for a, re a political organization such as Black Lives Matter that has literally done more measurable damage to the United States of America than ISIS even dreamed of accomplishing. We'll see you in the future.